Hey everyone, this is John Schneider with Fargo 3D Printing here at CES 2017. And I'm here in the Lulzbot booth with Kara Sawinska. So Kara, Lulzbot's been having a really, it sounds like a really good year. Um, has there been anything new that's come out with Lulzbot or kind of what's, what's 2016 been like and what do you see for 2017? Yeah, Lulzbot has had a great year. We had 2,782% three-year growth from 2012 to 2015, wow. which is so exciting. We're the number one fastest growing computer hardware company. Um, it's rated on the Inc. 500 list. We are the number two Colorado company, fastest growing as well. So here at CES, we're so excited to have um, both machines running, the TAS 6 and our Mini. And our new hardware product is the Lulzbot Morstruder. So this is a Morstruder print that was done on the Morstruder uh, with the Morstruder tool head. It's a high output, high strength tool head. So here's a comparison video showing the Morstruder compared to the standard tool head. And it can print up to 100 grams per hour. It's between 0.3 and 1.2 millimeter thick layers. Has an extra long heating block. It has um, dual print cooling fans and a 1.2 millimeter nozzle. So we're excited to be debuting that one, um, announcing it here. It will be released in Q1 2017. We also announced um, the alpha release of our Cura 2 uh, Lulzbot Edition software. That's okay. the software that's used to run our printers um, with the prints that you want to put in with it. So what things are going to be different with the new version of the Cura software from the current version? Yeah, there's different um, new features, um, added profiles and things like that. Our current version of Cura is version 21.03, which is downloadable um, from our website. And you can yeah, go on there and see all the different 30 different materials that we have already preloaded in there with the profiles. We've been working on the Cura platform for a while, improving features and working out bugs. And we're really excited about the progress in this version. Very cool. So back to the Morse Truder for just one second. You said it's going to be releasing when again? Um, Q1 2017. Do you have a price point figured out for that yet? We do not yet. Yeah, okay. at this time. All right. Uh, well, yeah, it sounds like Lulzbot's been having an amazing year. Uh, learned a lot that I didn't already uh, didn't know quite yet, so that's very cool. Looking forward to seeing how Lulzbot's going to grow in 2017. Great. Yeah, so, thank you. It's yeah. really exciting to be at CES and just be on the global stage here. There's so many cool 3D printing companies as well as other technology ones, so it's great to be a part of it. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, this is John Schneider with uh, Lulzbot here at CES 2017. Okay. Hey everyone, this is John Schneider with Fargo 3D Printing at CES 2017, and we're going to have to start over again.